Hey y'all, I'm gonna jump straight into this video right here. Don't mind my bonnet all in the camera. I'm I'm recording off my phone, so I ain't got no good setup. But I'm tracing all my letters and my stars and everything so I could go ahead and paint over it. I just finished tracing everything. Before I start painting, I always put paper down at the back of whatever I'm painting. So if I wasn't to put the paper, it would bleed through. And I'm using gold and white paint. So if I would just start painting without putting the paper down, I would have gold and white on the back. And it would be very noticeable. So I prevent that by laying paper towels and papers down in between. All right. That should be, a, that should be good. I'm just making sure like nothing bleed through the shirt because the shirt is very thin i'm gonna get started with this little painting process this is the yellow i'm gonna be using i'm gonna put it over here because i'm gonna go stand on the other side i like to look at the picture a million times before i actually start to like make sure i don't mess nothing up it's not gonna look exactly like the picture, but like I still don't want, you know. I'm gonna give it my own freestyle or whatever, but I just gotta make sure, you know, like, you know? Yeah. So, right here, I'm starting my background with my yellow paint. Um, he wanted the stars and everything, he wanted it, he wanted the background to be gold. So, I, it looks light right now, but as I kept going, it took me a couple of days to finish this just by itself it took me a couple of days to finish this part by itself but after like a million coats of yellow i got it as dark as i needed it to be you're gonna see that later on in the video and you won't be able to see none of those little mistakes that you see right now how it's like different colors it's not gonna be like that in the end i don't really know what to say like you just gotta trust the process you just gotta trust the process Cause in the end, it ain't gonna look like this baby. It's gonna look. <laughs> you gonna see? All right. So that's that. I'm gonna go ahead and paint white. We need to be painting white. When I was doing my background, I was using a little sponge to pat the paint on there. And right here, I'm just tracing over it again with my fabric marker, so I can see exactly where I need to put the white in. I just painted my letters. As you can see, I like retrace my stars when I paint local. Yo, I don't know where my footage went when I painted this. I did the background. I traced the letters. I drew a crown back there. I don't know where the footage at. So after doing the background, tracing the letters, all that, I had to outline everything in black. So that's what I'm doing right here. Just going in with some black paint and a thin paintbrush and tracing it in black. This is just a little progress video. This is what I got um, so far. I was so caught up in my music, I forgot I was supposed to be recording this. So, I'm about to start. I traced the fire on this side, but I didn't trace none on this side. These are the paint, but you know how they look first. I'm about to paint this yellow, gold kind of, I guess you could say. I'm about to do that.
ignore the fact that my head all in the way. I don't have no professional setup. I'm recording on my phone. Um, I don't really understand how I got the camera up there. So just bear with me until I figure out all this fancy YouTube stuff. Because I don't know what I'm doing for real. I'm about to do the splatter thing where you make the like the, you know, I'm about to show you all this. I'm scared. Okay, is it too much? I know it don't look like I know what I'm doing, but that's really just because I don't know what I'm doing. This is my first time doing it. Yeah, it looked nice in the end though. I liked it. That's what I'm working with. Um, I could fix that. Not right now, but you know, I could fix that. But this is how it looks. So, it's a lot that I have finished. Now, I really, really, really like the paint splatters. See, that I did. I like those. So now I'm about to just start with the back. I don't know where my footage went when I did the 2022 that's on the side of the pants. I don't know where the footage went where I did the back of the shirt either. Or when I finished the front of the shirt. But it was all the same concept. I'm finishing the back of my pants. I did the paint splatters already as you can see. And now I'm just going over with the first coat of white paint. And then after I finish with the white paint, I'm going to do gold. I'm finishing the shirt and everything. The paint is done already. I'm just finishing the shirt. I gotta add the paint splatters on this. I'm so glad I'm doing this without getting it on my shirt. I got graduation practice this morning. I'm supposed to be there right now. To my classmates, there was one thing why I was late. That's why I was late. Yo, you know my house door. I don't know why I left the door open. I don't know what was going on, for real. Okay, this is the shirt. Show y'all the back. This is how it looks. Got some paint on the sleeves. And these are the pants. I really, 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 really like the pants. Got the fire at the bottom. Got the paint splatters all around. This is what I'm working with. I like these, yo. Look how nice. I just gotta show y'all the pictures on when he put them on, y'all. He put it on for real. I really, really, really like this. Um, He won best dress. And he sent me a picture he won a TV, y'all. That was so funny to me. But thank y'all for watching. Stay tuned for the next video. I'm going to have more painting videos coming too.